what's going on YouTube so HPI RS4 3 Evo front bearing was leaking first I thought it was a gas tank or the gas lid ended up being the front bearing so did the old heater up with the heat gun This thing is still hot too. Um, there's the inner or the rear bearing. Oh, this thing's still hot. Um, here's the case here. So I'm gonna have to get in there and clean up some of that rust, which it looks like rust to me. Um, Just gonna clean this up a bit or as good as I can. So I have the new bearings already on the way. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and polish this thing up. Kinda rusted out, it looks like. Piston still looks okay. Probably clean that up a bit. The sleeve. So I get a good shot of the inside of the sleeve. The sleeve don't look too bad. Don't look like it's wearing out too bad. I guess there's the rear port. We got one, two, three. But that's the T3.0. There's the head. Had two shims on there. Clutch shoes still pretty look de look pretty decent. Springs are still pretty good. Flywheel is still pretty decent. Clutch is still pretty decent. So yeah, that's it. I'm gonna clean this up. We've got new bearings coming in. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and clean the shaft up. I was thinking of just taking the shaft out of this one here and putting it on, but I was actually wanting to use this motor here, but I couldn't because here's the issue I had run into. I put a clutch on it. This is a G3.0. So I put a clutch on it. Got that on there. Car ready to go, ready to be put in something. My only issue is mounts. So I cannot put this on that RS4 because of the mounts. It won't mount up. So I thought about taking the shaft, bearings, everything off, putting it on here, but then I'd just be wasting this motor here. So I have the new bearings coming in for this one. Get rid of the old ones. Clean all this up a bit and put it back in. Thanks for watching.